Welcome to Trailer Trash, the show where I review movie trailers because I'm too poor to actually go see movies. Today let's talk about this movie, Armored. I've seen a lot of previews for it, and most of them are in widescreen format. Whoever made the commercial decided that as long as it had that black space at the top and bottom of the screen, why not fill it with something? Like the movie title and release date. Call me nitpicky, but that pisses me off. The reason people will watch a trailer is because they don't know what the movie is. That's the whole point of a trailer. To inform an audience. I don't want to know what the movie is and then watch the preview. I want to watch the preview, think to myself, hey, this is pretty cool, I wonder what it is, and then learn the title and release date so I can be like, oh, that makes sense, or something like that. I know it's a little thing, but one that I'm sure affected how people felt about this movie. Namely, me. Um, let's move away from the trailer I've seen on TV a million times and talk about the YouTube trailer. I will admit, watching two one-minute cl clips from the movie and having no, I no idea what's going on really helps my enthusiasm about it. But Matt Dillon really doesn't. I have nothing against Matt Dillon, it's just the last movie I saw him in was Herbie Fully Loaded. Two things about this movie. One, I can probably count on one hand the number of people that liked this movie and weren't still wetting the bed. And two... The only thing that was fully loaded in this movie was Lindsay Lohan's enormous computer-generated breasts. I liked a few parts of the movie for reason two, but now I just go and look at recent pictures of Lindsay Lohan if I want to resist the temptation of masturbation. Total boner kill, Lindsay. Back to the trailer. Um, what I'm saying is that it doesn't seem like Matt Dillon can really deliver this like some someone else could, like maybe George Clooney. Not a fanboy, I'm just saying he's better at this heist stuff. <laughs> Ocean's 11, 12, 13. Come on, how can you disagree? Dylan doesn't even look like he's trying anymore. No offense to him, but he's got that permanent look on his face of, I already have a shitload of money, what do I give a fuck if this movie bombs? What I'm saying is, Armored looks like a typical heist movie with a little less plot than, I, than is hoped for. But, um, you know what? I'm still not going to see it because I don't have that kind of money. <laughs> okay. Catchphrase. 